up on the Adrenaline Project. Six beauty queens arrive at my base camp. So you girls are here to kick butt. Yeah. Don't let those sashes and tiaras fool you. These girls are tough. Hold that foot up now, go. But only one can move on and compete to be this year's ultimate Adrenaline. That's six competitors, three challenges, but only one winner. Here they come now. all dressy and everything, but I think I'm totally different from that. My name is Angela, I'm 16 years old, and my sports are volleyball and basketball. Competing in pageants has prepared me for the Jalen Project because now I know the sense of competition. It gets messy, but I'm up for it. My name is Selena, I'm 16 years old. I dance and I play soccer. I am amazing at stuff like this and I don't plan on losing. <laughs> My name is Brittany, I'm 15 years old, and the favorite sports that I play are soccer and volleyball. I think I'll win the Adrenaline Project because I'm a really competitive person. There's a side of me that always wants to be better than everybody. My name is Raquel, I'm 16, and I like basketball, volleyball, soccer, dance, and swimming. I'm going to beat all the girls here, and I think that they should be ready. My name is Shauna, I'm 15 years old. I played basketball, volleyball, and I also did track and field. I'm here to show that pageant girls aren't just wimpy, sissy girls. I look fear in the eye, and I will do a challenge, no matter what it is. Wow, look at what we got here. Six beauty queens competing in a pageant I like to call the Adrenaline Project. Problem is, only one of you will be crowned the winner. That means five of you are going home. It's okay, because I'm going to be the one that wins. Why is that? Because I have what it takes. I put the adrenaline in the Adrenaline Project. Shauna! Yes? If you were to win this, how would you make the world a better place? It's a very good pageant question, sir. I'd make the world a better place to show kids that it's not right to give up, to go for what you want, and to achieve greatness. That's a good answer. <laughs> Why, thank you. Purette. Yes? You think karate will help you in the events you see here? Yeah. You girls afraid of the ninja here? No. no. They should be. So you girls are here to show that pageant girls aren't just pretty, they're here to kick butt. Yeah. Well, it looks like you girls are a little overdressed for this occasion. So let's get you in some different gear. Let's get you training. Let's go. Okay. I'm sick of social graces. Show you shop tips. Go. Let's roll those tires. Come on, let's go. The person I think that stands the least chance here is Selena just because she seems more on the girly side. Two girls down, let's get back up! Since I'm the reigning Miss Teen International, I do train the other girls. Because the other girls look at me as an authoritative figure, I do have the one up on them. Shauna is my best friend and she's just the person I want to beat the most. We're both at the same athleticness and it's going to be a good competition with her. <laughs> it's alright, it's alright to be me. It's alright. Queen's doing. Good. Good. This is your first event. It's called On the Line. I'll be shackling you into groups of three. You will grab the rope and follow the rope trail through the course, going up and over and in and out of all of my barriers. Once you get to the other side, untie yourself out of that knot, pull yourself out of the rope, and work your way up the middle of the course to your flag. First three to raise their flag, guaranteed their spot in tomorrow's second challenge. The other three, well, I got some plans for you. Brittany, Pirette, Selena, Team Green, Shauna, Raquel, and Angela, Team Red. All right, girls, let's get you geared up. I'm nervous about trying to fit into those boxes, but yeah, I don't want to lose them. I'm a very high achiever, and I don't want to win by a mile. I want to win by 10, no matter what. I'm moving on tomorrow's challenge. You girls ready? Yeah! yeah. To an early lead. Break, sorry. You go down. Come on. Come on. Come on. Angela, you got 
Look, push this out. Push this out. No, no, get out, get out. Okay, push this back. You just gotta go through this. Now that's two opposite strategies. Shauna's team is plowing through, and Brittany's team is taking it slow. Push yourself back. Push yourself back. Pull that foot up. Now, go. You need to go see and give her leeway. You need to pull that rope. Pull that rope. I need leeway. I need leeway. Red is moving on. Okay. Okay, no. Go, go. Green is catching up. When you guys pull the rope, it won't pull this rope, guys. You have to go underneath. Green team is thinking things through. Guys, we got it. Green takes the lead. Um, Brittany pulling out those sandbags. Red team is so eager, they got themselves all tangled up. You don't want to be going home first day, girls. Brittany, don't go. Don't move. Good communication, Green. Shauna, you ever work on a ship? You're pulling that rope like you're raising a mast. They're my girls. I got to do it for them, you know? Green going through the bridge of rungs. Slow and steady, though. Slow and steady. Okay, okay, I got you. I got Come you. on, Red. Think it through. Green's gonna be working on the knots soon. Okay, I'm amazing at knots. I am too. I can pull it. Green is on their knot. Red still in the same predicament as they were before. Starting to hear some frustration coming out of Red. Take off the string. And pageant rock. Red still having trouble. Woo! Green coming back, running it in. Pull the flag together. Ready? That's it. Green wins. I think the green team took it slow. They thought it through. They said, okay, let's wait. Instead of me, I'm a go-getter, I just started pulling stuff and hoping for the best. Congratulations, girls. How do you feel? Good, Good. thanks. Thank you. Good. I got a problem. I got three girls going to tomorrow's challenge, but I need four. So we're going to have ourselves a little event to decide who's going to be the fourth. Red team, come over here and line up in front of your pot. Oh, my God. <laughs> That's disgusting. <laughs> I haven't even said what we're gonna do yet. Basically, what's gonna happen, whoever pulls the most octopus tentacles out of their pot with their mouth in 30 seconds will be moving on. Myself being a vegan, I don't eat any animal products, so that's not cool. <laughs> on the whistle. <laughs> When I saw an animal in this tank, I had to put my beliefs aside and I had to, you know, I had to get down and dirty. How was that? Disgusting. Don't ask. Beautiful. Well, congratulations, Shauna. Thank you, thank you. You'll be joining Brittany, Pierrette, and Selena in tomorrow's second challenge. Angela, Raquel, you did a great job, but unfortunately, you couldn't suck it up and get those tentacles on the plate. You're headed home. Say your goodbyes. Win it for me, okay? All right. I knew eventually I was going to get eliminated, but not the first day. It was a real surprise to me. I hate losing. I feel bad that it blew my second chance. I am disappointed in myself. Well, you got through today. But if you want to get through tomorrow, you're going to have to get down and dirty. Head back to camp. Yeah. Coming up. Come on, got to catch up. I thought she was a lot stronger. I guess looks can be deceiving. I don't mind getting dirty, but the poo, on the other hand, is a different situation. Here at the Adrenaline Project, uh, I'm scared I'm going to do something that may hurt me. I do have pageants coming in. And if I have cuts and scrapes and bruises, it wouldn't look that great on stage. Do you know, if you want something bad enough, you know, you'll fight for it. back to camp, it was just a sigh of relief and then bubbling up from your stomach of, oh, no, we got to do it again tomorrow. My picture's going to be on that board. Your picture's going to be in the newspaper that says missing because y'all got lost before. <laughs> <laughs> I think Boomer's hint about the next challenge was kind of revealing, but we don't have to worry about anything tonight, but tomorrow morning competition will kick in again. The night was long and I didn't get much sleep. And I'm anxious to see what Boomer has planned out for us. How many do you think we're going to get? 
Shauna earlier was complaining that she didn't want to get bumps and bruises because she does have an international competition in Costa Rica coming up soon. Oh. <laughs> Real quick, hold on. I just gotta kind of look at what's uh, what's more important to me, I guess. This one's called Pig Pen. It's gonna be pretty funny to watch, too. <laughs> On my go! Each contestant will try to wrangle their pigs individually from one through five and place them in their color-coded boxes. The first two competitors to wrangle five of my little piglets up win and are moving on tomorrow's third and final challenge. The last two? Well, you're headed home. Let's get you girls ready. I grew up in the suburbs. Like, I have no idea <laughs> about pigs or anything. You girls ready? Yes! Go get them! All the girls running around trying to get their first pig! Shauna, get your butt into that pen! Shoot my shoe fell off. <laughs> it smells disgusting. Oh, they're all <laughs> Selena gets her first pig! <laughs> no, not the big one. Brittany ties it up! Make sure you get those pigs in order, girls! <laughs> Selena with their second! Brittany with their second! Pirate and Shauna are way behind! What's your problem, Shauna? We're not asking you to eat them! Shauna loses a shoe! Shauna with their first! I beat my biggest competition and I am so excited that I did that because now I have nothing stopping me. Shauna, Purette, you did a great job out there, but it just wasn't enough. You two are headed home. I don't know, I'm pretty disappointed that I didn't go fast enough because I really wanted to win. I thought Shauna would be the one to win. Everyone thought she had it in the bag. I think I was going too slow, you know, with the mud and my shoes got stuck and I was going to more of my international pageant. I guess it kind of means more to me. Brittany, Selena, congratulations. You two are moving on to the third and final challenge. How's it feel? Good. <laughs> now that I see how well you two can work on the ground, I'd like to see how you manage in the air. Head back to camp. <laughs> see you. Bye. <laughs> what that means. Oh. Hey, guys. I'm disappointed in myself because I thought I could have won. I just want to say that I'm glad I did this. It shows that pageant girls aren't just all pretty and like, we could get dirty and we could do whatever we want. I think I, I did let Brittany down. Her and I, before we are talking, you know, us two final two. So Shauna did end up deciding she didn't want to go through with it anymore. I think that is kind of a poor way to be, but I know that that's something I would never do, is just give up because I didn't want scratches. Have fun tomorrow. We will. I'll be thinking of you when I'm falling 25 feet or whatever it is. Coming up! Brittany's down to the drink! I'm not going to let my fears bother me. I'm going to do everything I can to win. My brother said if I don't come back a winner, he's not my brother anymore. <laughs> <laughs> I'd like to push my body to its limits by being on the show. I think my biggest weakness right now is my asthma because I can run fast, but I can't run for very long periods of time.
expect it to be just as lit? Well, no. If Shauna was here, the competition would have been really fun, but now it's kind of like me against Selena. One of us <laughs> is going to win. <laughs> I think that Brittany got a lot of support from Shauna, and now that she's gone, I don't think Brittany will be as strong. I think today I have a good chance of winning. I already put my picture on the picture board. <laughs> Miss Teen Worldwide, Paisley McNabb. It was really cool meeting Miss Teen Worldwide because she is what I aspire to be. Hi, Hi. nice to meet nice you. Nice I'm pretty nice to meet you. Paisley's here to help crown this week's winner. Well, congratulations for making it this far. Thank yeah, you. Thanks. Now, I don't want to interrupt your little meet and greet here, but we got a third and final challenge to take care of. This one's called Walk the Line. <laughs> On my go, you girls will jump into the lake, swim over to the other side, climb up the ladder, and shimmy over to your flags. Once you collect your flags, jump into the drink and swim over to the bank. First girl to raise their flag. Crown Miss Teen Adrenaline Project. Let's get you suited up. When I first saw the final challenge today, I was kind of excited because I do live near lots of lakes, so I'm a pretty good swimmer. I'm a little bit nervous. I'm wondering how deep that water is. <laughs> you girls ready? Yeah. On the horn. to how I'm feeling right now. I am ecstatic, like. <sighs> I am really disappointed right now. I did not realize that she had both legs and I would have tried harder if I seen sooner. I didn't, I thought she only had one. Good job, girls, now get over here. Brittany, Brittany, Brittany. <laughs> you fell in that drink one too many times. Yeah. That means you're headed home. Thanks for meeting you. I'm just in shock right now because I didn't think it'd go by that fast and 
Keine Ahnung, ich habe auch jemand. Congratulations, Selena. You were the queen of balance and strength. That makes you Miss Teen Adrenaline Project and this week's winner. Thank you. Congratulations, you did a wonderful job. Thank you. Head back to camp. I thought it'd be okay at the balance, but it was so much like core strength, like. I was surprised how Selena did. I thought we would be a really good competition. I didn't think she'd beat me. See you. Bye. 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 I thought I would have done better. I just, I don't think I was strong enough. Selena. Hi. It's got to feel pretty good. You proved you to work out as a team and on the line. You showed you weren't scared to get down and dirty and pink pen. And you just pulled it off huge in this last event. You've been crowned this week's winner. You're coming back at the end of the season for a chance to compete to be this year's ultimate adrenaline. And you get to put your picture on my winner's board. I'm feeling pleased and proud right now. I'm just kind of letting it settle in that I won this. <laughs> I have a pageant coming up in three weeks. And by winning on the Adrenaline Project, it's boosted my self-esteem. At the pageant, I'm going to show those girls a thing or two. Want to keep track of who Selena will be facing off against in the semifinals? Log on to theadrenalineproject.com. And next week... I can trip someone if it's necessary. It's dirty. Oh, it's harder than I thought. It's wet. Scared of scorpions? Scared of her. And it's creepy. I've never encountered something like this before. This week's winner of the Adrenaline Project will receive a Quicksilver backpack and a mountain bike courtesy of Mongoose and Schwinn.